You know the argument you keep having, the issue that's been on your mind or you've had to revisit or address every few months. The same one where the other person in the equation says, why are you always bringing up the past? Let it go. Well, first, if anyone is consistently repeating the same offenses but claiming you're harping on the past, try responding with this. I'm not bringing up the past. I'm bringing up the pattern. And it's the pattern that's not okay with me. The thing is, in order for anything to change, that has to be true. You won't be able to stop them from doing a single thing they're doing or convince them to do something they have no intention of doing. But when it comes to the cycle, if you don't like the pattern they're repeating, you also have to challenge yourself on the pattern you're repeating. Are there boundaries? Are there consequences? Does that person receive the same access and ability to handle or mishandle you each time this happens? There's no judgment. Often, we don't know how to hold up consequences or accountability with people who tend to bulldoze and manipulate their way into their way. So we fuss and fight and harbor resentment, but then inevitably give in, and the cycle continues. But a good starting place is with the phrase, because you chose, I'm choosing. This simultaneously holds them accountable for their actions, but it also challenges you to stand in your boundaries and worth.